Here an example of Bodhi plot and its application. A transducer feeds a first order low pass lag network with cutoff frequency of 200 Hz. So the question is, what are the approximate phase and gain values at 2.4 MHz? Well, given that it's a first order low pass lag network, we can approximate the response of the network by the system like this. So H omega, omega frequency is equal to omega C, which is the cutoff frequency in radian per second, divided by J omega plus omega C. Reason for this format is then it would give us a nominal gain of 1 at DC. So for the gain, or for let's say the magnitude, H omega square, uh, absolute value is omega C squared divided by omega squared plus omega C squared. When omega approaches DC, of course this value becomes 1. And then omega goes to infinity for super high frequencies, the response, the magnitude response goes to zero, because the denominator becomes infinitely large. From Bode plot, we approximate this behavior like this. Initially, at DC, at very low frequency, the magnitude response in dB would be 10 log 1, which is 0 dB. So it remains like that, and at omega equal to omega C, we approximate from that point on, till infinity, for every 10 time increase in frequency, we get 20 dB reduction in the magnitude. So that's why we say 20 dB uh, reduction per decade, uh, or 6 dB per octave, which means twice the frequency. And that corresponds to this uh, magnitude response behavior. And for phase, we have the phase of H omega uh, for this system would be minus arc 10 of omega over omega C. When omega approaches DC, of course, this gets to zero degree at omega equal to omega C, right at cutoff frequency. This is arc 10 of minus arc 10 of 1, which is minus 45 degree. And when omega 2 goes to infinity for super high frequency, V approaches minus 90 degree. That is approximated in phase body plot like this. So for frequencies below one tenth of omega C, we can easily approximate the phase to be zero degree, like as if we are at DC. Then beyond that point, the phase start to linearly goes down, go, going down, um, and at omega equal to omega C, it becomes minus 45 degree as, as we discussed here. And then finally at omega equal to 10 times omega C, we can approximate the phase to be roughly minus 20 degree. And from that, that point on, we treat the phase as if uh, the, it's, it's omega for uh, super high frequency, the phase is constant at minus 90 degree. And that's the phase body plot for this first order low pass lag network. So given that the cutoff frequency is 200 kilohertz, it's as if you're talking about this point uh, in a frequency scale to be 200 kilohertz. And given that the target frequency or frequency of interest is 2.4 megahertz, it's as if it's roughly 10 times more than that. So we are beyond this point. So we can approximately say that the magnitude or gain value would be 20 dB at least, less than what it was. So we can approximate by saying the gain is approximately minus 20 dB, actually a little bit less than even this. And the phase, since the phase we're talking about something like this point, is approximately minus 90 degrees.